Electrification is a key factor for uh, sustainable mobility. So a lot of railways have been built in the uh, beginning of 20, 20th century or end of 19th century where they didn't take care about the structures. But when now electrifying the lines, you need to accommodate also the electric line, which needs certain distances to the st these structures. There was a tender for electrification of uh, the whole railway network in Denmark. And Denmark has a lot of structures where exactly they have this problem and therefore we wanted to find a good solution to be competitive for this line. And finally, with our solution, we also were able to succeed and, and get the contract. In the first step, um, we looked into the standards. What clearance can we achieve at which voltage level? And we found that this is quite low compared with the voltage levels we have on conventional arresters. So we put these parameters together and ask in the engineering department for the arresters whether it is anyway possible to have such an arrester. And Thomas, after two days, we got the reply, yes, we could produce such an arrester. The Siemens search arrester actually protects valuable equipment against overvoltages, like lightning strikes or switching overvoltages. The challenge for the Danish project was to protect the bridges and tunnels due to the missing clearances. And uh, to have a stable, safe and trouble-free uh, operation, we developed a new arrestor. That means we had a medium voltage arrestor combined with a curves and high voltage arrestor to protect the tunnel despite the missing clearances. It's an outstanding solution and of course such a solution uh, cannot just be applied as you have invented this. It, you need uh, to fix it in standards and norms. The standardization is a long-term uh, process and uh, for uh, tendering, uh, for a short-term uh, process, we, we need acceptance and a sh very short confirmation. And this was uh, a difficult approach and we have done this. The idea can be transferred to the power transmission for sure. And uh, we are looking for a new innovative overhead line concept to reduce the dimension of the structure by 30%. That means it would have a big impact on the conservation and to challenge the energy transition globally. Siemens. Ingenuity for life.